All right, Coach Frederick, yes, sir. Hall of Famer, what does it mean for you? Well, it's, uh, you know, actually it's a tremendous sense of uh, accomplishment, you know, what signifies that, uh, you know, work that you put in did not go unnoticed. You know, folks that have tuned in to the things that we've done, uh, at Calhoun, myself as a player and a coach, so I'm, I'm very happy about it. And, and uh, you know, feeling, feeling great about the fact that I'm going in with such a great group of people and also by the folks that are already in the hall. So, uh, to me, I'm, I'm ecstatic and I'm very happy about that. Well, it's been 33 years since you last scored a point in this place. Are you surprised that so many people still remember your, that no, season? I'm not surprised they remember, you know, most of these guys have been around forever. <laughs> and uh, they don't ever forget. Uh, they're great Carolina fans through and through. So uh, they could probably tell me some things about myself that I've forgotten. So I wasn't surprised. I mean, it's, it was very uh, humbling the fact that they do remember me as well as they do. You talked about how important it is that they remember you as a player, but also just what you've done as a coach. Just for yourself, what's your coaching accomplishments? Why do you think that should really stand out just as much as your playing days? Well, you know, I always say that, you know, playing was, to me, was the easy part. Um, you know, you're just a young kid out there just trying to do some good things for yourself. And it speaks more of uh, what the game actually is doing for you in terms of opening doors and allowing your opportunities in your life. Uh, coaching, to me, is, is more me trying to give back. It's me actually giving more myself than I did as a player. So that's that's why it's, it's more it's just as significant to me. You lifted off so many accomplishments, the eight state titles, which is tied for John Smith for most the Maloney coach, the winning streak. Just considering the issue we've had with the SCACA, just does this and considering that you looked at not too many coaches, high school coaches that are in the Athletic Hall of Fame, does that just make it extra special for you? Yeah, it does. Um, like I said, it, 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 it tells me that uh, people have noticed what, what we've done, what we've been doing. Uh, and, you know, uh, I love what I do at Calhoun. And you're right, the uh, Coaches Association, for some reason, even during the time when we were, you know, uh, in the 81 game win streak and winning four state championships in a row, uh, we was basically overlooked in, 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 in terms of uh, individual awards. But, you know, my. My thing has always been that I'm more concerned with what my team does as long as uh, they've been doing well and I've always been all right with that. But, you know, just like you said, it it really is special for me at this point to be uh, elected to the Hall of Fame as you know, player and a coach. And, uh, you know, maybe some folks need to take a second look at the way they do business.